So Focus AI released their new upgraded version named Defocus AI in which you can go ahead and change clothes very easily and quickly than the previous Focus AI. And not only that, it is a lot faster and a lot accurate than the previous one where you can change clothes of your model in the most challenging pose that you like. So yeah, let's just go ahead and explore that tool out. All right, so if you guys are wondering how you can download uh, the new DeFocus uh, AI, so it's really, really simple. It's just a one single Google Collab link, so which I'll provide you down in the description below. So yeah, when you will click on that, so this will be a very simple interface for your Google Collab where you send DeFocus, nor the interface DeFocus, Focus Fork. And simply, you need to go ahead and click on this one cell and click on run anyway. And it's going to go ahead and start the work for you in no time. And it will take like not too much, just a couple of minutes. And it's going to access the defocus AI for you in no time. All right. All right, so after all that, it's going to basically provide you uh, the link where you can run this on local URL. So you're going to go ahead and open that. All right, so when you will click on the link, so this is basically uh, the interface for a uh, defocus. So it is a very similar uh, and intuitive interface as we saw previously uh, in Focus AI. So yeah, we have the similar options like generation, then we have the option of input image and advanced. So if you go ahead and click on these buttons right over here, so it will give you a lot of more options of upscaler variation, image prompt, in paint or out paint, describe and all those other options as well, all right? So yeah, uh, first of all, if we go ahead and explore uh, the defocus uh, AI tool itself, so it creates a very amazing looking images. Like take a look at this image, right? So I just typed in my prompt, which was a really simple prompt, a female with white dress. So this is basically the type of image it provided me, which looks really, really good. It looks absolutely perfect, right, you guys? All right, so now if you want to go ahead and change clothes with Defocus AI, so there are two methods for that. So first of all, you can either go ahead and put on your dress into Defocus AI, and with the help of that, you can go ahead and create models and create variations of model wearing that particular dress. All right, so how you can do that, so for that, you need to go ahead and go to uh, this image prompt option right over here, which you can enable by clicking on these buttons, input image and advanced. And after that, uh, you need to go ahead and input your dress that you want at the defocus AI, create the image for you so that the model can wear your this particular dress right over here, all right? All right, so one thing you need to make sure uh, that the background should be removed uh, for your dress right over here. So if you want to go ahead and do that, you can simply uh, do that with the option that defocus provides you right over here which is remove background so you can input your image click on generate and it will basically remove the background for you for your particular image and if you don't want to do that uh, in defocus as so simply uh, you can do that in third party apps like i did in remove backgrounds it will go ahead and do that for you in one click only so this is really really simple as well all right all right, so after you are done inputting uh, your address into your image prompt, then there are a few parameters that you need to make sure. So you have your stop at value at around 0.85 and your weight value at around 0.85. 96 or 97 because these are the best settings that I found uh, for changing dress in defocus AI all right and after that uh, you need to go ahead and choose uh, your aspect ratio according to your dress so I'm going to go ahead and select one by two this looks good and you know after that uh, you just need to provide in your prompts so I'm going to type here a female wearing red dress cityscape okay so this is a really a simple prompt that i'm going to go ahead and input so now let's just go ahead and generate and see whether it will uh, take this dress and create the perfect image or perfect output for me all right all right so here you go guys take a look at this image right it looks really really good like it caught our dress like almost perfectly so here is uh, the dress that we input in our image so yeah with the help of that you guys can see it basically created the model for us of wearing that particular dress. And this image looks absolutely perfect, like very, very accurate. Right, guys? So this is our first method. So let's just say the second method, you want to go ahead and, you know, input your model and you want to change the dress of that particular model. So how you can go ahead and do that in the new defocus.ai. So it's really, really simple, yet it's really interesting as well. So for that, you need to go ahead and go to 
image prompt once again go ahead and upload the dress that you want to change so let's just say i'm going to go ahead and choose the same a red dress but this time uh, i'm going to choose my own model instead of asking the focus to create that okay and yeah for that uh, you need to make sure your stop and invade values are same 0 0.85 and 0. Point around 9 6 or 9 7 all right so after you're done with that you need to go ahead and go to uh, this advanced option right over here click on this developer debug mode and simply a uh, click on this option which is mixing image prompt and invade so this will basically go ahead and enable you to mix your image prompt and in paint so you can do both you can choose your own model you can choose your own dress and you can change that with the help of defocus.ai right so this is really interesting all right, so after you're done with that, you need to go to this in paint or out paint option because you're done with the dress, right? Now you have to choose your model. So over here, you need to go ahead and drop the image of your model that you want uh, to change the dress for, okay? So for that, first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and choose uh, this model right over here. She is standing at some grocery store and she's wearing a dress. First of all, I'm gonna go ahead and in paint uh, the dress of this model. So we're going to go ahead and do that really quickly, you guys. All right, so when you're done uh, with all of the in painting, so after that, you just need to go ahead and click on generate without typing any prompt right over here. So I'm going to go ahead and delete my prompt. Simply click on generate and wait for the output, all right? All right, so there is our final image, you guys. Like, wow, take a look at this, how accurate this is, right? So this was our dry site over here. This was our model. And just take a look at this. Like, this has changed the dress of our model very, very perfectly. No deformation whatsoever. So yeah, this is a very fast method now in Defocus yeah, where you can go ahead and change clothes of your own model. And you can choose your own dress and simply implement both of these things in one go, right? So yeah, so now I'm going to go ahead and do one more example for that. So yeah, this time. So I'm going to choose this green dress right over here, right? This looks good. And yeah, make sure that your parameters are at the same values. And after that, I'm going to go ahead and choose my own model, which is uh, going to be this one this time. Okay, so yeah. Now let's just go ahead and in paint the dress of this model. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and simply click on generate after that, all right? All right, so now it's all done. And yeah, now let's go ahead and simply click on generate. And let's just see the output. All right, guys, so there you go. Wow, this looks absolutely perfect. Like it's almost very accurate to the dress that we uh, input. And yeah, this looks really, really good. This was the dress, this was the model. And yeah, this is the final image. Yeah, it is absolutely fantastic, right, you guys? So there you have it, guys. This was uh, the exploration of how you can go ahead and chain dress now very, very easily with the new updated tool of Focus, yeah, which is Deep Focus. So yeah, I hope you like this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.